not scared of sharks. <laughs> well, hello and welcome back. Thanks for coming back downtown Get a Fafos. It's a truly, truly spectacular evening indeed. The sun has started its descent off to downtown Cato, Australia. It's getting ready to welcome the Queen of Oz, our girl over there, Miss Helen. But before we get on a little walk down the Cato Papas Promenade, I'd like to introduce you to the most beautiful woman in the world. And of course, her name is Miss Ochin Gracivia Labouf. Hello, everybody. How nice to see you again and again. Shall we go for a walk down the Kedapathos Promenade? Shall we, shall we? Shall we, shall we? Oh, we shall, we shall. Shall we, shall? <laughs> Let's go for a little walk down the Kedapathos Promenade. We'd like you to come with us. You never know. We might meet some old friends, and you never know. We could meet some new friends. It's the downtown Kedapathos Promenade. This is the little area provided by the municipality with little piers and little steps that allow you to transcend down into the blue, 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 blue Mediterranean Sea. It really is a spectacular evening indeed. And as you can see, there are one or two people swimming away in the Mediterranean Sea. And of course, it's very, very good for you indeed. And it makes all of your troubles go away. Grisivi? Oh, I would love to swim. I know that there is no any sharks here. If anything, you can sharks on the ground rather. Well, they are indeed. On the mainland in downtown Paphos, most of the sharks are swimming in and around on the downtown Keda Paphos promenade. And of course, unfortunately for you, so are we. Let's keep going. There's one of the balloon girls. She's, uh, well, tempting people with some of the big floaty balloons, the Mickey Mouse balloons for example, they're five euros a pop if you want the ones that rattle and uh, light up in the dark, they're seven euros a pop. This is the downtown Kedapathos Promenade, there's restaurants, there's bars and there's an awful lot of people frolicking around and having a great great time indeed. This is the ideal snack bar coming up, very very popular indeed. Tonight the weather's a little bit chopsy mopsy as you may have noticed but still the temperature, if you're wondering, you know, perhaps if your name is Miss Dawn, you've got a husband called Mr. Sean, a little cat called Miss Daisy, and a very, very clever dog called Bobo. The temperature today at 7.30 at night, by the way, let's stretch it that little bit longer, 25 degrees. That's not bad, is it? Feast your eyes and digest. That is the blue, 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 blue Mediterranean Sea. It's looking pretty blue to me. The sky's not looking too bad. It's pretty blue. Mr. Paul is dressed head to toe in blue. All that's missing is... All is missing is you. So get yourself on a big bird or a canoe and start paddling like crazy. That's because we all are patiently waiting just for you. Shall we keep going? Shall we? Shall, shall we? we, shall we? We're on the downtown Ketapathos promenade and we're strutting our stuff, hoping to bump into some old friends and some new friends. That one over there, how do you say that, Chrissy Blue? The Bacchus, Mr. Bacchus. Father. You know, I would like to tell you that uh, Mr. Paul is a godfather. He's christening all the restaurants and all the hotels' names because he cannot pronounce, because he's... Uh, English. Well, there we are. Prince Welsh. of Wales. The Prince of Wales. And so if saying, you want somewhere he's saying, renamed... He's saying King Elephant in, instead of King Everton. Exactly. And, and we've got the Louis mm, something beach hotel Louis as well. Louis How do you say it? Fayetteon. The Louis Fighting Hotel on the downtown Yerskifu Beach. This is downtown Cato Pathos Promenade. I don't even think I'm pronouncing that quite correctly. But this those of you... She did. She checked in over there. But this time, Justine and Mr. Andy, they're not bringing the little doggy called Ollie, 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 Ollie. No, he's getting left in downtown Staffordshire. Perhaps he's going to go and test drive that blue BMW and make sure that that rear end keeps wiggling around. Well, they're checking into the Avanti Hotel this Mr. time. Mr. Ollie, thank you for Licky Lick. <laughs> there we are. She likes a good licking now and again. Downtown Kedapathos Promenade. 
as you can see there's a bit of chops in us there's a bit of cappuccino on top of the blue 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 Mediterranean Sea but it really really is a truly spectacular view indeed and a spectacular place for you to come whether you're coming for a weekend if you're coming from downtown Tel Aviv in Israel perhaps further afield in downtown Krakow if your name is our superstar Miss Anastar yes Yes, everybody, we love you all. Everybody is so, so important to us. Anasta and I told you on camera and I will tell you one more time. What a shame that I've missed that very moment. But I had to be somewhere else. But next time, I'm not going to miss it. And Ronnie Smiri, thank you for appearing. And I read your lovely comment. You made me smile. Shall we have a bit of a twirl? for the girl known as Dame Anne. There we are, that's the girl in charge of our show. She's all the way in downtown Hartlepool. What do you think of that top, Miss Anne? What do you think? I think the pants we've seen before, the shoes we've seen before, but I don't think we've seen that top before. I've got an idea that that may have cost me a couple of bob. You know, I like to combinate the things. Something that I had before, I get very, very tired of new things. I get tired of buying choosing and buying it's very hard job she's lying now she never no. gets bored of choosing things or buying things as long as they're with somebody else's money so on that note remember that very very clever dog indeed called bobo well if you'd like to click through to our about page you will find the little platform it's called buy me a coffee click on that icon and it'll take you straight through. You can register one of your cards and you can make a very, very small contribution to the channel as a thank you or a salute. Spectacular sunset, isn't it? Have you seen it really, that? really is indeed. Receive me, I am talking to the people about money. Please, please do oh, not yes. distract us. It's a very, very important thing distract to talk about. You. Distract. 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 Not de-strap. I'm gonna de-strap you later. What does it mean? What distract uh, take your attention away oh, somewhere else like doggy doggy. so there was well, she's fantasizing about dogs and things like that well I'm talking to you about the buy me a coffee platform so if you'd like to buy us a coffee or two as a tip or two a thank you or you'd like to go and do a special special video for you you drop in the comments a few coffees and guess what that video will be coming especially for you there's one of the superstars on the downtown Keda Paphos promenade and harbour area she really is a legend all the way from downtown Hungary and she really can take all of your troubles away so if you spot her please give generously the season appears to be long but of course the season is actually very very short indeed so if your name is Lord Dave Jono why not buy us a coffee and guess what We'll transfer your cash into her cash live on camera. It... What's going on here again? Well, it looks as though the Gumbaroos have had a bit of a day off again. We told him before, please, please get more people to come down and change the bins because as the season ramps up, it's not even busy yet, wow. and the bins are overflowing. What a beautiful Receive it? sunset, Mr. Paul. It looks like uh, everything, not everything, one part of the sky, it's dark, dark grey. And then that very little window i should say and this is a sun which is trying to go to sleep it is indeed that is the sun that is well departing cyprus that's for sure and it's going to appear in downtown cato australia especially for our queen of oz the lady known as miss helen and of course he'll be coming back to cyprus to cook us all over again at around about 6 30 in the morning so don't worry if you're in downtown Keda Papos on your holidays. Well, let's keep going. We've just gone past the captain's table. We've just gone past the Moorings restaurant. We've got over here the English Rose restaurant, which of course is one of the favorite places for, well, Miss Izzy and Mr. Allen to hang out. We are so, so sorry that we missed you, Miss Izzy, but don't worry, next time we're gonna make an appointment and we're gonna come and storm your hotel reception and drag you out and go for a swim with you and all those kind of things. Now. The superstars coming up. I'm going to leave the camera showing that as it starts to set in the sky. The superstars coming up are complaining today because the weather's been a little bit chopsy mopsy and there's a bit of a breeze. Who's coming up first? Well, the most beautiful woman on the downtown Keda Paphos Promenade. Her name is Miss Katerina. And of course, her partner in crime is the superstar known as Mr. Constantinus. Bonsoir. Beautiful as always. 
Warm? Cold? Is it cold? Oh, it's a bit cold. It is a bit cold. Have you been busy? Not today. Not today? But you're having a day off no, today? If it was every day... You'd be too tired. <laughs> you would. It's a long, long season and long, long hours. They start from about 9 o'clock in the morning. They keep going right into the night. And if you want to know what they do, well, choose seashells if you want your name or a special message on one of those and then you want it to be hand-painted by the superstar known as Mr. Constantinus, or perhaps if you want your name on a grain of rice, on a bracelet, on a necklace, on a key ring, it could be for your cat, it could be for your dog, your auntie, your uncle, or even that neighbour next door. Starting off at eight euros a pop. Your name on a grain of rice in English, in Swahili, even in Chinese, ending with an Oh, oh, there we are. If you want to know on the name of your name, that's the man to come and see. He used to work for the tea company called Taifu. Oh, there we go, look at that. Very, that's very, called true very, very love. Near. That's what it's called, true love. It's dangerous. It's dangerous. He makes a couple of bob and her hand comes over and caresses his thigh. And on the way out, it steals the money. Absolute legends on the downtown Cato Paphos Promenade. Let's keep going. There's one or two more superstars for sure. There's the balloon girls. There she is, one of our favourites. And there's our second favourite. There we go. You want a fancy balloon? That's the place for you. Now, he's flossed his teeth. He's brushed his teeth. He's mouthwashed. He's brushed his hair. He's even brought his partner in crime with him. That is the legend known as Mr Chris. Welcome back. How are you doing, Chris? All right. Have you had a busy day? Very, very busy. Well, I know you have, because I've been here for a few hours, and I sold you one or two things for you, you as well. You most of them. I did indeed, yes. <laughs> So I'm coming for my commission now a little bit later. He's going to be very, very sorry indeed. What does Chris do? Well, he is the greatest Mediterranean sea sponge salesman in the world. If you want one of these natural growing organisms from the blue, 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 blue Mediterranean Sea, this is the man for you. We've got small ones. We've got middle-sized ones. But the best ones ooh, are the big ones. At only 15 euros a pop, it's going to last you a minimum of two years, but probably four to five years. And that man wouldn't lie to you. No, no, no. no. The customers come back year after year after year after year, again, again and again. And they keep coming back to that man because he is the greatest, greatest Mediterranean sea salesman in the world. And today, I helped him sell a couple of those, by the way. We sold one to an English gentleman and to a Polish young man, and they thought they were absolutely spectacular. Genuine teeth from a shark. What kind of shark is it? Bull shark. And it was a dead one, I assume? Yeah, of course. Yes, of course. We wrestled it to the ground and detoothed it, and then we cooked it and we ate it, and it was delicious. On top of that, he's branched out into the worldwide sales of seashells. So if you want a special, special seashell, this could be the place for you. If you're all the way from downtown Prenton on the Wirral, I think that was the one that you bought. So if you work in a dentist, that was the perfect, perfect shell for you. And of course, there's an awful lot of choice and an awful lot of things. Special, special little mementos to take back all the way to, well, colder climates. Thanks, Mr. Chris. Thank you, Girol. Hello. I hope you're right. Daxi Parol. Where is he? In Turkey. He's in Turkey, isn't yeah. he? And he's uh, Mr. Chris's best friend, and he does exactly the same thing in downtown Turkey. So if you're looking for a special, special sea sponge, and you're in Turkey, that's the place for you. Have a look at that. That's Chrisiva the booth. You know, without exaggerating the things, today, this morning, I took my little sponge, I've got three little sponges, and put in a hot water, and put a little bit of uh, face wash on it. On the other side, <clears throat> it was nothing. And I did just go through the face and then put it in the cold water, hot water, cold water. And you can't imagine the face becoming so soft and so silky that I was really glad about the result. And you're even more beautiful than normal. The most beautiful woman in the world now. If you want to get that special, special trinket, that special, special thing from downtown Keda Papos, I'll tell you what you need to do. You need Lina. to get braided. Hello. That's Miss Lena. Come and say hello to Miss Lena. And there's some of her previous victims, so you understand what she does. And there's one or two more of those previous victims. They've all lived to tell the tale. They all 
put their hands in there and they chose the twines and the colours that they wanted and then they dived into there and they chose some letters and some colours and that girl braided the living daylights out of them when she wasn't smoking when she wasn't smoking there we are so if you want to stop this girl from smoking get and see her and go and sit your bottom right on that chair and cross her palm with a little bit of silver and you'll make her mum a very very happy mum indeed thanks miss lynn we'll see you later she is a star she really, really is. She's got a great, great smile. But as you come to understand, she's smoking that little bit too much. Well, Stevie, it's no, time for the big doesn't. goodbye. Come on, you. She it's doesn't. the joke, isn't it? It's a joke of us, and we always will joke like that. And I would like to tell you that I truly, truly enjoyed today's work. Uh, w work? Work, walk. Sorry for my French. And then I um, really, really like that I put something a bit long sleeve. And that's because the weather, it's very enjoyable. You can't feel any humidity. You can't feel any sharks or the Rottweilers at the wedding. No, there appears to be Loving no you. Rottweilers on the downtown Ked of Patmos Promenade. If you're watching, Anne-Marie, Mr. Michael, your princess, Miss Kaylee, there's no Rottweilers in downtown Ked of Paphos today. And I think a big shout out to Mr. Paul and Miss Michaela, who understand that little joke as well. Thanks it's for watching. So pleasant today. I really, really enjoyed. And if you only were here with us, but next time you will, hopefully, we're loving you and kissing you from the bottom of our two hearts. Thanks for watching. And of course, we will see you again very, very soon indeed.